In the early years of the war, the Allies depended heavily on the P-40 to gain control of the skies. During the dark days of 1940 and 41, the P-40's lethal firepower brought hope to the Allies and announced to the enemy that victory would not come easy. The P-40's technical performance was often no match for its adversaries. But the shortcomings of this durable and powerful fighter did not prevent it from becoming one of the deadliest aircraft of the war. With its trademark shark tooth snarl, the P-40 prowled the skies over Europe, China, North Africa, and the South Pacific. The aircraft's superior durability, diving abilities, and firepower gave its pilots advantage over their enemy. German and Japanese pilots quickly learned to respect the plane's strength and to fear its six 50 caliber guns. Known as the Tomahawk, the Warhawk, and the Kitty Hawk, several variations of the P-40 comprised the first line of Allied fighters on numerous battlefronts. A staggering 13,000 P-40s flew into action in nearly every theater of the war. In Europe, North Africa, the Middle East, the Far East, Russia, the Aleutian Islands, and the Pacific, the P-40 delivered its punishing blows. Nowhere did the P-40 make a bigger mark than in China. For years, the Japanese had conducted massive bombing raids over Chinese cities with no opposition. But that changed in December 1941. Under the leadership of General Claire Chenault, 100 shark mouth P-40s, flown by volunteer American pilots fighting under the Chinese flag, began their brave resistance. Using Chenault's aerial tactics, the underdog P-40s dealt Japan's flying forces a series of devastating blows. By January 1942, a small group of American pilots were holding off the mighty Japanese in the skies over Burma. Their Chinese hosts dubbed them the Flying Tigers. These men and the P-40s they flew went on to become one of the greatest legends of World War II. The P-40 was a rugged and powerful design and was available in huge numbers when the Allies were in desperate need of fighter aircraft. With guns blazing, the deadly P-40 blew away its lightweight enemies, kept its pilots safe, and ensured the Allied Air Forces would live to fight another day.